How's it going? Actually, we can establish crime scene, so I need you to stay over on this side of the sidewalk. What's that? We can establish a crime scene without setting up tape. Strzok oh, you can? One seven six. Can you stand over here? Establish, Don't go any farther. Establish a crime scene. Don't go, go any farther past the Establish a crime right scene. Go ahead. Don't go any far. far go ahead. What's your name and your badge number? I already said it's Strzoky four one seven six. Man, he's got both her IDs. How can you have the passenger's ID? Huh? How can you have the passenger's ID? Huh? Hey, just so you know, as a passenger, next time they pull you over, you don't have to identify yeah, yourself. You to... Only the driver has to. So you don't have to give them your ID. You don't have to tell them nothing. Huh? Yeah. Did you make it seem like it had to? Or did you just ask? Just ask? Yeah. yeah, in the future, you don't got to tell them anything about who you are. <laughs> you no, know, we're just out here for you, man. For reasons just like that. Just like this, because they do stuff they're not supposed to, you know? It might be minor, but, you know, you didn't know and you just gave it up. You know, that's what they rely on. They don't tell you, can I have your ID? You don't have to give it to me, but can I have it? I mean, had he had said that, would you have given it to him? I didn't want to give him any reason to think that you're hiding something. Right, that's out of fear, right? Yeah, I mean, I feel the same way. You know, everybody feels that way when you get pulled over. These guys are scary. Right. Mm -hmm. What's your phone number? That's other bits of information. They don't have to give up. Yeah. And also like that, how he asked for your phone number, you don't have to give him your phone number, just your first and last name. That's it. Yeah, and you don't have to be like, well, I don't want to give it to you. You just, uh, I don't feel comfortable giving you my phone number. Is that required by law? So, you know, you can politely ask them, and they should tell you if they're honest. You know? Oh, look, you got back up. Yep. How's it going? How's it going? Actually, we can establish crime scene, so I need you to stay over on this side of the sidewalk. What's that? We can establish a crime scene without setting up tape. Strzok oh, you can? 176. Can you stand over here? Establish, Don't go any farther. Establish a crime scene. Don't go, go any farther past establish the Establish a crime right scene. Go ahead. Don't go any far, far Go ahead. What's your name and your badge number? I already said it's Strzok 4176. You guys didn't put the tape up or what?
So and this is under threat of arrest, right? Are you gonna, yeah, are you gonna What's arrest that? me if I don't move? Well, there is an ARS that says if you guys are interfering with the traffic stop, we can we can actually establish a crime scene. Right. What's what ARS is that? What's that? What's the ARS on that? I mean, I'm saying, are you threatening to arrest me? Is what I'm saying. If I don't, if move. you're interfering with the traffic stop, yes, we will. If How we're interfering interfere, with the traffic so stop, right? Then we can move. establish a crime scene. So therefore, if you interfere with our crime so scene, if you interfere with our crime scene, we will arrest you. What's up, everybody? It's AZ Avenger here. Now let's take a look into what this no-neck meathead has to say. Arizona Revised Statutes 1324-13, Interfering with the Crime Scene Investigation, Classification, and Definition. A. A person commits interfering with the crime scene investigation if the person knowingly disobeys a peace officer's reasonable verbal order to remain off the premises of a possible crime scene or otherwise interferes with the peace officer's crime scene investigation. B. This section does not prevent a person from peace observing a police proceeding if the person does not interfere with or obstruct the peace officer's crime scene investigation. C saying it's a class 2 misdemeanor and D for the purpose of this section crime scene means an area where a crime has possibly occurred and a peace officer who is on site has determined that it is necessary to restrict the public's access to the area until any potential evidence of the crime at the scene is identified and observed. Victims and suspects are identified, and if necessary, any emergency medical care and ambulance transportation is requested. You guys want to go up here? That doesn't make any sense. If you're okay. interfering with What's our the... crime scene, then we can establish a crime scene. You can scene. go right so up are here. You, are you saying we're interfering? What's that? Are you, are you saying, saying we're interfering? interfering? Right you now. Said if, if we're interfering, you can establish a crime scene. So are we interfering? You're interfering with our crime scene. How? I'm telling you right now. You're what evidence is here to preserve? Scene. You can establish a crime scene. Your crime scene's the vehicle. Okay. Right, right, right where the sidewalk is. Your crime scene's the vehicle. Like I explained to him, it's Strocky four one seven six. All right, we're gonna go. All right, we're gonna go right here to the, the south sidewalk right there. To the south sidewalk. Keep going. I'll I'm tell going. you when to stop. Yeah, we're going. We're going. Keep going. We're going, baby steps. You're actually bro. probably trespassing on somebody's property. So no, well, actually, <laughs> there stupid. you go. They have to call you and ask him to leave. Nice try. We're walking. Nice try. Baby steps. Keep going. Baby right, steps. We're moving. Keep going. There's nothing that says steps. how fast I have to go. We're moving. Yeah, baby steps. Right. Baby steps. Right there is perfectly fine. Right there. Do not cross this line. What no, line? What line? Farther. What line? Do not go any farther. This south. line? What line? Right here. Which one? I can't south? see this where you drew right that line. This one. I can't see where you drew it, so. I can't see an imaginary line. I'll get to you little asshole that way. Was it this line or that line? I don't know. This I, I can't remember. Can't remember. Is it this one or this one? Hey, your qualified immunity? Go ahead. Do something stupid. I dare you. How many houses you got? Oh, you got a lot? Because guess what? You not stopping him doing what he's doing? Now you involved yourself in the lawsuit as well. So what's your name and badge number? Are you directly involved in this? It doesn't matter. Oh, you're it's dumb. You you're, you're dumb. You want, you want to get a fucking policy <laughs> violation. You better talk to Coke. Yeah. Go and get our new policy. It's been updated. That's what I heard, but then I talked to the lieutenant and he said you're full of shit. So yeah. fuck you. Yeah. Nice try. Which lieutenant? No. Okay. You answer my questions. I don't answer yours. You're the one that's talking to me. Man. You're the one that's talking right, to me. So I know you are, but what am I? So this is your ticket. Yeah. Sorry, these guys are here, so we can't violate your rights anymore. Yeah. Pull you, guys, pull you guys out and beat you up or something. Now, can you remind me which line it was again? Because I forgot. There's a bunch of lines in these this sidewalks. One or this one? I can't remember. I, I don't know if it's that one. one. There's no physical this line one? to show me where the barrier is. So can you establish a barrier, please? Uh, I have already a know I like going to jail, so do something dumb, dumbass. <laughs> Fuck around and arrest me. Go ahead, punk. Hey, hey, Mr. Hey, Mr. Mini Houses, what kind of cars funny? you got? You think that's funny, punk? Yeah. Why? Well, I want to know so that way when I fucking take your qualified immunity away, what kind of cars I'm going to be getting in the lawsuit, so. Yeah. Oh, that hit his ego a little hey, bit. Look. Sure, that means detainment's over. Yep. Time to go. Time to go. Time to go. Time to yep. Kempton, 100442. Kempton, all right. Cool. You're fucking dumb. You know that? This is the kind of shit that goes viral on the internet. You like going viral? Is that why you're doing this? That's why he's telling him to dip. And look, he's blocking the street with no emergency either. You like the attention? Is that what it is, Strapper? You like the attention? 
You like going viral, millions of views on the internet, looking dumb as fuck? You can have a yeah, go night. fuck yourself. Hi, princess. See yourself on the internet. Hey, does your wife pull your hair? Or your boyfriend, sorry. Oh, there you go. Keep the lawsuit going. Thank you.